Have you ever made a bread, flavored with clay, or shaped a Play-Doh? Imagine being, bringing the same malleability and ease of shaping into advanced ceramics, such as magnesia, zirconia, and alumina. Traditionally, shaping of ceramics has been challenging. Once sintered, they become brittle and difficult to machine. You can even lose your precious cutting tools at this stage. And the loss is not limited to material itself alone. Consider the significant energy that you put during the sintering process, the process to make these ceramics harden at high temperatures. And the industrial reports 35% loss at this stage. Ceramics are the oldest material that humankind tries to shape, yet we still haven't cracked their knee at shaping. To shape them, we need intricate designs for 5G antennas, aerospace application, and dentistry application. What if I told you that there is a game changer in the works? What if we can impart a clay-like rheology into advanced ceramics? Imagine what we can do to serve $15 billion market. Picture self-standing doors of malleable advanced ceramics. These doors are formulated with a single polymer to homogeneously coagulate the ceramic particles. At a maximum two weight percent additive, these doors exhibit a clay-like property through polymer bridging, making them easy to shape and mold, much like a Play-Doh. And the best part, they reach 99% of their theoretical density upon sintering. In my PhD, I use alumina to formulate these doors. I have optimized their machining parameters to digitalize ceramic manufacturing. Moreover, I have expanded the materials portfolio from a single component system of alumina to a multi-component system, the CLOs. Well, it doesn't stop there. Let's talk about circularity. While ceramics are lagging behind metals and polymers in terms of recyclability, these doors are 100% recyclable, aligning perfectly with the principles of circular economy. Moreover, when you want to design intricate shapes, you have to imagine bringing intricate shapes onto your ceramics without losing their integrity, all with forces less than 10 newtons. It's a game changer for ceramic manufacturing, opening up new avenues for creativity and innovation. But when we look towards a future of circularized ceramic processing, we need to make them accessible, affordable, efficient, and then sustainable than ever before. We are not just shaping ceramics manufacturing. We are shaping, we are not just shaping of the ceramics. We are shaping the ceramics of manufacturing. Thank you.